hi guys welcome to my channel how to and today what I'm going to show you is how to do fades and crossovers when you're making a video or if you've got pictures photos and you want to transition from one photo to the next starting off this could be a video or a photo but I've just got a photo there and it plays for four seconds now what I'm going to do is from this playlist and all I've done is I've gone into my files, opened the file and then just like dragged them over. I'm going to put this one next to it there. Now a quick tip, see how it's there and you've got that gap and then you can just go right click and close. A quick tip, what I'll show you like on the next one, when you pull it down, even if you pull it from the source area, see the white shade, just pull that to it and just bam, it just, that's where it will close and also make sure you've got this magnet on because look the magnet's off now and when I try and put it together it's like see I'm, I'm missing it and it's going over and it's like it's, it's hard and I'm always going to miss a gap yeah if I've got this magnet on yeah oh shit no where's it gone there magnet if I've got this magnet on I grab it as it gets to the end it just plump it just like psh, magnifies together anyway playing these clips now you're just going to see it's just going to go one to the other straight to the other watch bam straight to the other and straight to the other so there's you know there's there's nothing to it really there's a it's just there's nothing special about it now the first one what I'm going to do is normally what you used to have to do was go on to filters, click on filters, go on to fades and then type in the seconds. No, all you do is go to the top hand corner here and there. See where it goes the pointy bit and the circle and you get that, you just press on it, your finger on it and you just pull it to the left how long you want it to fade for. So now let's play and see what it's like see how it slowly goes see how it slowly goes down but then because this side has got no fade this one just comes in too quick as well so if we do the same on this side take it back to there now watch this nice and smooth now if we was to carry on with the next one there's nothing so now another way which I want to show you like a crossover is when you get this all you need to do is is just deliberately go over it and when you go over it if you look at the count there you can see how it says look it's on zero go over it and then it shows you how, how many like of a second of tenth of a second it's going to be showing for so at the moment it's two tenths of a second now Let's quickly go over that again. Right, we're going to put it there. And now, instead of it just going, like, slowly going out of, out of picture dark and then coming out light, it's going to do this instead. Watch this. See, uh, you can actually, as it's crossing over, you can see the other picture. So it kind of your picture fades out but you can still see it and the next page if, and the next picture fades in so that's two ways there so let's go over the two ways from the very beginning and then i'll quickly just go over it again what we did the first one on the fade goes slowly out and in and then the second one see how it transitions over so if you remember on the first one all we done was we went into the corner there and dragged it across if we need to go back more we just do the same thing get it and bring it back and same with this one grab it and bring it back but we don't we don't want to do that do we we want to leave it so let's just get this again and there and this one let's make the let's make the let's get rid of this remove and now let's make the fade even bigger just after that this is just a big example this is 
and because it's a photo I can stretch this out you can always stretch photos out but you can't with video just remember that so now let's see what we've got now and instead of pressing play just press the space button look I'll move that press the space button on your keyboard now watch this because dark comes on and crosses over nice and smooth did you see that but I just I weren't too happy there with this crossover on the second one so what I want to do is let's just move this up here this there the magnet and we're going to stretch this out more it kind of it happened too quick didn't it it happened a bit too quick so let's stress stretch this out a lot more and bear in mind if you if you bear in mind look i've got i've got the channel this here this only lasts for the whole of 12 seconds it's because i've got this here down you can have it magnified up or magnifying right down where you can't see it or magnifying right up and i've got it right up at the moment do you get what i mean but if you click on this button here it just stretches it out to the page you can see so now let's have a look now because darker slowly comes up and fade nice and slowly and I don't know whether you realize them there was a bit of a there it kind of it, it flashed and the reason why it flashed if you have a look I must have accidentally I'll have to get rid of this remove I didn't do it right so now let's have a good look space yeah that's better and now the crossover coming in brilliant and that's professionally done and that can be done with video or photo and that's all it is so I hope that uh, helps you for today please like and subscribe and check out my other videos because there's loads of other how to tutorials in my videos for shot cut even and uh you're going to be well happy with this look at my videos how to find out whether a video is copyrighted to stop you getting a warning to stop you getting a strike three different ways on my videos where you can do that and also tools on how you can grow your channel faster so they're what you need because you don't want warnings and you don't want strikes because your first warning you only get the one and i wish i knew and i and i tell you three ways how to do it and then I also show you on different feeds where to get the videos from. So look at all my channels. I mean all my uh, videos on my channel. You'll see them. The ones with the mainly in red thumbnails. I also teach you how to make thumbnails on here. Anyway, that's it for now. You all take care. Catch you on the rebound. Bye.